Hi guys, today is another technique tweaks tutorial. Um, haven't been uploading in like a while, so I thought I'd do one today. My net's back up, so I don't have any problems with the net these days. So I'm back up and uh, thought I should share this video with you. I was at school a couple days ago and uh, one of my friends, while we are in IT, um, he decides to put my friend's computer off. So I'm like, okay, fine, let him do his work. But uh, probably a joke around, so he can actually do that. So I thought, you know what, let me just shut down his computer. So uh, what I did was um, I went into uh, CMD and I actually viewed his account, IP address, whatnot, all of that stuff. And um, I got I got his computer. Issue. What you want to do is you're going to go to uh, start menu here and you're going to type in CMD. Now once you have CMD, you're going to right click and uh, just like always you're gonna go run as administrator okay bring it to the front okay you're gonna type in net view now before I do this I'm gonna tell you that um, you need to have the all these computers that's on school on the same network wireless network and LAN network it's fine now I'm the only computer like over here so I can't really do it to myself but I'll show you how to do it now once you uh, type in netview, netview basically shows like a, a list of uh, the server name because that's all the computers that's con connected to that network. So what you're going to do is you're going to go ping and the person's name or the computer name. My In mine is my name. Some might have dash PC but uh, mine doesn't so yeah. Now as you can see pulled up my IP address and whatnot in the brackets. What you want to do is you're going to go to shutdown dash i. Now this little screen will pop up and we, now as you can see um, this is what we need basically. So you can see this basically this GUI has basically whatever you need for that computer to get shut down. So you're going to go to add and you see this in the brackets here. This is the stuff you're going to need every time. It could be different, it could be an IP address, this is, I forgot what you call this, but this is one of them. And you're going to type that in here, so I'm not really going to type that because I don't want to shut down my own computer. But yeah, and uh, you can warn the user, you don't have to warn the user, you can type in how many seconds, what not, what you want to do, restart shutdown, unexpected shutdown, you can also leave a comment. I normally put a comment, stop shutting down, whatever, whatever, you've been hacked. And um, that that's basically it. And you press OK afterwards. Now OK button is not selected because I don't have I didn't add a computer yet. But um, when that's done, that's all you need. Have fun with that. Um, one more thing. Now you see CMD might not always be unlocked on a com um, school computer. So what you want to do is what I normally do is I got a Notepad. I'm gonna code this. Okay, I got a notepad. Once notepad is open, you're gonna type in at echo. It's a simple code, so it's not long. At echo off. Enter. Command. At echo on. That's it. That's basically it. Now um, you're gonna save it as. What can we save it as? Let's say cmd dot bat. You have to go dot bat basically means you're gonna it's gonna run like a program okay and I'll put it in downloads yeah I'll put it there and uh, I can close that now and I can just go to downloads and basically what happens is that it's going to be saved here right there okay it's gonna be saved and you can just double click and there's CMD unlocked all yours thanks for watching uh, technique tweaks I will be commenting on videos and everything. Sorry for the whole wait, it's been like a year. So um, I'm back. Technique Weeks. Thank you very much.